Hi there, this is a video to accompany my Hackaday.io log post on this ESP32 smartwatch project. Uh, link to the log will be in the description. Uh, just This is just a demonstration of some of the changes to the firmware of the watch itself. So one big thing that's changed is the display now uses a frame buffering system. So we're able to actually update the entire screen all at once instead of drawing individual pixels. Um, this contributes to things like allowing us to add animations, use bitmaps as backgrounds, and, you know, the text now, when it changes, doesn't quite flash as much. Uh, another big component with, uh, since the last log was the addition of the notifications. So you can see here on the home, the notifications are displayed uh, just kind of as basically as possible on here. But if we want to actually see more, we can go into this menu here, which will show us the apps that are giving us notifications. And I can, you know, select one of these, and it'll show me more or less what the what the notification says and this is all forwarded through the android app oh sorry and this is all forwarded through the android app that i created to accompany this watch uh information about that will be in the heck dio page post so you know i can come in here this is just a fake notification that i made with an app off the store but we're able to read notification data so that's all the major changes since the last log uh, the watch is coming along nicely, and there's still some work to be done, but yeah, it's in a good place now. We're making good progress. So thanks for watching. See you in the next update.